to my beautiful wife, Monique, I cannot believe that in just a few hours we are going to be a husband and wife. I am so blessed to have you by my side forever. So many emotions are running through me right now and I cannot explain how happy I am. I just want to tell you, thank you for always being there for me and always being supportive of me throughout the times that we have been together. Most of all, I want to thank you for encouraging me to strengthen my relationship with God since we started attending church together. There are no words that can ever fully express my love for you. Today I'm ready and more than excited to become your wife. I am so grateful that God has placed you in my life. I truly believe that you were chosen for me. I could not have asked God for a better life companion. You are my absolute best friend and my soulmate. Soon we will stand before God, our family and our friends, bow our love to each other. I promise to always love, honor, and respect you for as long as I live, and I will always carry you in my heart. Our relationship has never been better, and I promise to always be the spiritual leader of our family. It amazes me to think of all the stuff that we have been through together, from watching movies and playing Mortal Kombat, <laughs> to not being able to ever sleep at the cottages, to now owning our own house together. I cannot wait for the fun adventures that God has planned for us. I will pray for you and our marriage daily. I appreciate you for who you are and you, who you have caused me to be. From this day forward, let us grow in the Lord together and individually. Let us make life decisions together. Let us raise up raise a family in Christ. Let us be quick to love and slow to anger. Let us be understanding. Let us let God direct our and guide us in our marriage and in our walk with Him as husband and wife. I promise to always love and support you, Monique. You are the love of my life and my heart and soul. I'll see you out there, my love. Love, TJ. I love you, TJ. I cannot wait to spend forever with you. You are my world. XOXO, dear lady. look at these rings and you realize how beautiful they are, these symbols of the vows that you've just shared together. You realize that just as your vows are precious, that these rings are precious, they're made of precious metals, precious jewels. You also realize that just as your vows are unbroken and should always remain unbroken, these rings are unbroken circles, the symbols of your love. So every time I encourage you that you hold hands that you look at these rings, you realize that they are symbolic of the vows you've shared today and your pledges to each other. So Tomas, if you'll take Monique's ring and as you place it on her finger, will you repeat this after me? With this ring, Monique. With this ring, Monique. I pledge myself to you. I pledge myself to you. And I promise my love to you forever. And I promise my love to you forever. The same way, Monique, as you take his ring and place it on his finger, will you repeat this after me? With this ring, Tomas. With this ring, Tomas. I pledge myself to you. I pledge myself to you. And I promise my love to you forever. And I promise my love to you forever. One of the unique things, Tomas and Monique, that you've chosen to do today is build a unity cross. And what a unity cross is really a beautiful sculpture that you will hang in your home.
but it's symbolic of your lives joining together. And as your lives are joining together, they're joining in on the foundation of God, of Christ in your marriage. So I'd like to ask you to join me. So what these pieces are, Tomas, this piece of yours symbolizes everything that you bring to this relationship. It is the strength, the leadership, the characteristics that you bring to your relationship. Monique, in the same way, your peace is what you bring to this relationship with your leadership, your strengths, and your characteristics. And as you join those together, then they will be joined with this nail, which is symbolic of God holding your relationship together as the foundation, as the support, as the strength of your relationship. And so now, Tomas and Monique, by the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife, and Tomas, you may kiss your bride.